It's one of the worst things that can happen to anyone. Watching the things you love go up in flames. But after a fire at the Wild Pumpkin in Beaverton, owners Lori and Jeff Hadrick found that they were being looked after. Corey Adkins explains in this week's Northern Michigan in Focus. At 11.48, there was somebody pounding on our door, and they were, they were going to break down the door. I mean, we were coming out of the house. And literally, I opened up the door, and she's like, your barn's on fire. Imagine complete strangers pounding on your door in the middle of the night, screaming your livelihood was on fire. Enter guardian angel number one. And they were so incredibly nice. I don't know their names. I know nothing. But I do know that they were willing to help get any animals out. They kept screaming, tell us what to get out of the barn. And of course, you're tired and confused. And I'm like, wait a second, barn one's on fire. There's no animals in barn one. Luckily, no animals were in immediate danger. 911 was called, and the first responders did what they do. They were the Hedrick's second guardian angels. I mean, they even parked their fire truck between our house and the flames. Okay, that, you know, I don't know if that's typical, but that led me to believe that my house was their first priority. Four departments came together and just did what had to be done. They were incredible. And I, between the lady and the firefighters, they saved our farm. The fire was out, the wild pumpkin devastated. Then, Guardian Angels number three hit the scene. Employees were on it right away. It was Beaverton's homecoming Friday night and Saturday, and we had orders for over 500 donuts. And so it was all hands on deck. Everybody's like, we can do this. My paint at pumpkin employees, they paint all the pumpkins. And she, the one lady showed up Saturday morning with a car full. She's like, I just stayed up and painted pumpkins so you'd have pumpkins to sell. Incredible. Even Gears Farm from McBain called. Called and told me, bring a trailer, pick all the pumpkins you want out of my field and sell them. He's like, no charge. With all these guardian angels looking after Jeff and Lori at the Wild Pumpkin, they were able to open the very next day. All the animals were fine. They still had thousands of pumpkins. They just have one last miracle they'd like to pull off, and please listen. If you were the couple or know the couple who was on Beaverton Road at 11.48 p.m. on September 21st, 2018, please stop by the Wild Pumpkin and say hi to Lori and Jeff. They really want to thank you. She did something incredible. You know, kudos to her. She gets brownie points for the whole rest of her life because she did something big. And you know, not only does it affect us and our family, it affects our employees and it affects all the customers that come here every year and make memories. Wild story, right? But my guardian angel pulled in that night. And I don't know if I'll ever meet her, but she's pretty special. For Northern Michigan in Focus, I'm Corey Adkins.